a Monster High review on Operetta. Let me just get my UCAM to pop up. Okay, there it is. So, Roller Maze Operetta. First, before I do anything, I'm going to say this is my first YouTube, and I've been trying to do it for three times. The first time, I accidentally hit stop recording. The second time, I accident um, it disconnected. It an air. It had an error and it disconnected, and this is my third time, so, again, this is still my first, but this is still counts as my first Monster High video, so. I'm finally allowed to make a YouTube video. I'm not allowed to show my face until I'm 16, though. Actually, my mom changed it to 20 since I said that. Anyways, I'm going to start with the helmet. Um, her helmet has a really cool, it has a, a hole for her ponytail, and it has this thingy right here, a thingy that goes on the original doll. It comes off and it moves around. If it comes off, it can move around. But the really cool thing about it is that the pattern of it is really cool. There you go. So that was the helmet. That was the helmet. Yeah. That was the helmet. So now it's time for Operetta. Her hair has the original black and um, red hair with black streaks, but with the Roller Maze dolls, it's supposed to be green on, on the card. It shows up green. See right there? On the card, it shows up. It's supposed to be yellow on the card, but on the doll, it turns up green. I don't know why. But anyways, she has purple, I mean green eyeshadow on. Uh, too close. <laughs> and she's got that beauty mark that one of the girls on Wookie Warrior has. Close to their eye. So, now that we're done with her face, oh wait, no, and she's also got this little tattoo, her birthmark, you can get it to show, there it is, yeah, that's her eye, there it is, it's right around in this area. But it's a birthmark, and it goes to down to a really cool tattoo that is spiderwebbed with red mu music notes mixed in there. Um, that's her tattoo that goes up t to the birthmark on her face. And now we can move on to her dress. Her dress is really cool. It's got a little collar, but nothing connected to it. It's got no shoulder holes. It's got um, records on it, and it's got this little pop-up thing on her belt that's also a record. And now it's time. She does come with um, knee pads. I just can't find them. No elbow pads, so she got um. There's like uh, -uh. like a top of a sock pattern on the top, and then like right around in this area, there are spider webs, and then this is supposed to be. This is supposed to be the lacing. And then there's also some spider webs down here at the toe area. And then the wheels actually move. We don't know if you can notice but the wheels are rolling around the screen. So 
the wheels are mismatched on one. It's it's um red and it's pink in the front and green in the back. And on the other, it's green in the front and red in the back. So that's something that I think is really cool. Oh, so. So now, I will, um, and on the box it does say, if I can rock, I can definitely roll. Oh, and right here, I like music notes. And then on the card, it's a picture of her. And it says, Operetta. And on the back, it has a picture of everybody. And it's up to Jim. I have this one. Now wait. Ah. Where is it? Okay, there it is. It's really hard taping when you're not allowed to show your face. I have this one, I have this one, and if I can get Operetta, this one. I have Operetta and Laguna. Hopefully, tonight, Santa will come and give me Frankie and Gulia. Uh-oh, my computer plug came out. Okay, so, that's Operetta. Subscribe, thumbs up, and when I get at least five thumbs up, I will make another video. Because I know that people will actually like it. And don't just do it because you may want me to make another one. Okay, bye!